This morning in Michaela and Amami, we are talking about the importance of skin-to-skin -skin contact. Might sound familiar to you, and we're going to explain more with Dr. Megan Dalton of South County Health. Good morning. Good morning. This is a concept that might seem new to a lot of people. Maybe if they had their children years ago, this wasn't so common. Um, now more and more parents are hearing more about skin-to-skin -skin contact. What is it? Why is it so important? Yeah, so it is definitely new. Um, it's really important. It basically is as soon as the baby is born, we put the baby right on mom mm -hmm. and we do that right after a vaginal delivery so it comes right from our hands right to her chest um, we try to take her gown down or any clothes she might have on down a little bit and put that baby right on her skin mm -hmm. we do it in the operating room as well right after a cesarean and it's really important it increases the bonding that mom has um, we leave that baby there for an hour two hours as long as mom would like and it actually the baby itself will start to find its way to the breast and start feeding which is extremely beneficial um, a lot of moms, they try and breastfeed. It's, it's easier said than done for a lot of folks. It is a struggle. So the fact that that could maybe aid um, yes. in the breastfeeding process is extremely beneficial. But a lot of health benefits, too, even for baby. First of all, the babies won't be cold, even right. though they're fully exposed, right? <laughs> right. No, definitely. Um, being on mom's chest and hearing mom's heart rate or feeling that, uh, it helps regulate the baby's own heart rate, mm -hmm. help regulate the baby's breathing, because that's one of the biggest transitions for the babies when they first come out, is to transition to breathing on their own and, yeah. and realize that all of that. That shock of new life. Exactly. And so it can help actually calm that down regulate their breathing, regulate their temperature, mm -hmm. their heart rate, all of it. It's great. And like you said, this is something that's more and more encouraged, not only for mom, but for dads, too. Yeah, so, you know, mom has all the hormones that are going on, which helps her with her bonding experience. Mm -hmm. But if you do a little bit of skin to skin with dad, then he'll release some of those hormones on his own, and it increases his bonding experience as well. So if mom can't, then yeah, we put the baby on dad. Or even, mm -hmm. you know, if mom's you know, later in the time, having a break, then we put the baby with dad. And while this is happening, like you said, it might be for an hour or two, things can still be, be done just to make sure baby is of good health and any, anything that needs to be checked can be done at the same time, right? Oh, absolutely. The nurses um, or if the pediatric provider needs to be there, the pediatric provider can mm -hmm. do all of that while the baby is on mom. Great. If, you know, the baby's getting the medications, the routine the babies get right after delivery, they mm -hmm. get those right on mom. It doesn't delay any of the care that the baby would get. And you encourage a lot of either skin to skin or just having um, the baby in the room with you a lot, which means that we don't see a lot of open nurseries a lot no. of times anymore. No, so that kind of movie thing you see in the movies where dad's all looking in the nursery. Like, right. We don't really have what we call well baby nurseries anymore. Mm -hmm. We do rooming in, the baby stays in the room the whole time skin to skin and all of that. And so nurseries are really more of a thing of the past. Yeah, and, and that is I can only imagine such so like a sudden moment. There's a lot going on. So maybe having even the feel of that newborn baby must calm kind of everyone's nerves, right? It, it probably provides like a nice, safe, loving environment. Oh, absolutely. It, it definitely calms mom down a little mm -hmm. bit. You know, she's just gone through a big experience. Um, it calms her down a little bit. Um, it also calms dad down a little bit, you know, like yeah. the baby is right there. And so those two most important people in his life are right there next to each other. Mm -hmm. um, and he can be right there. He can, you know, put his hand on the baby or with mom. Right. Um, and so it definitely kind of calms the whole room down a little. Absolutely. And I know they say too, even as your pregnancy progresses, like they can start to recognize your voice, hear your voice, know your sounds or your heartbeat or whatever it might be. So I'm sure that a kind of familiar feeling is beneficial right out of the gate. <laughs> Absolutely. You can tell that the baby calms down, you know, mm -hmm. right away and they can, like I said, you know, smell mom, hear that heartbeat that they've been listening that to bond for is nine right months. There. Yeah. And it's it's automatically there and the babies calm down so quickly. It's amazing to watch. Really beneficial stuff. Thank you so much for coming in and sharing more important for gosh mom, baby and dad too. If you want to review this important information you can go to roadshow.com.